Hello friends, welcome back. My name is Himanshu and in this video we are going to understand about a very important organizing tool and that is conditional formatting. From the very name you can make it out conditional formatting is the tool which is being used in order to organize the data or format the data based on various conditions. There are few predefined conditional formatting options which you may go for and those are very easy to implement and also very useful but apart from that there are a few customized options as well that we will also explore so let's start first of all we need to understand the data here is the name this is the date of entry which is not in a proper manner these are the sales figure marketing cost and you may see the profit which has been set by a formula a simple one which is sales minus cost and we have got the profit now first of all in the sales figure I want to highlight all the sales figure which are above 55,000 so in order to do that first of all I will have to make a selection of all this complete data so I have made a selection of the sales range from starting from C3 till you may see that C37 and I want to highlight all those sales figure which are above 55,000 so the procedure to do that you need to go to the home tab and in this you will see the option of conditional formatting click in this option and then the first option we are going to use right now which is highlight sale rules now in the highlight sale rules there are plenty of more options so the option which I am going to use it's the greater than option so click on greater than option and there you will see by default it has taken one figure but it's not the figure that I'm looking for I want 55,000 so you may type it manually 55 thousand and by default the color is light red fill with dark red text I don't want this there are plenty more option like yellow fill you may see the changes over here there are few more option like green fill with dark green text so that is what I believe I was looking for green uh, fine but uh, if you don't like these options which are here you may go to custom format once you have clicked on the custom format you may see this font uh, tab and in this font tab uh, you may give the color option that you want that's the color I have given if you want, it, uh, want to change the font style you can do that like italic bold or bold italic I have uh, selected bold and this is the fill color fill means the background of the cell so fill color I am going to consider a bit light color okay click on ok and click on ok once again you may see that the format that you have set it has been changed into that format based on a condition and that condition was 55,000 greater figure so all those figures which are greater than 55,000 are formatted now it works on a live feed what it means actually let's say this is the figure of Mr. Bira but if this figure uh, let's say one of the cell has not been considered and the actual figure is not 73,169 it's now 54,360 so it will become uh, the formatting will be removed from this and let's say Mr. Omar has made few more cell and the figure has reached up to 56,000 so automatically you will find that the formatting has happened so this is how you need to set a conditional formatting there are plenty more options into this so let's go about that now another important aspect that we need to understand that if you have set a conditional formatting rule then how to remove that because I have made a selection and if I will go to home and this fill color I have done no fill it will not make any impact in this because this is the formatting which has been done based on a condition on the cell range so in order to remove the conditional formatting from the cell range again you will have to do the selection and then go to conditional formatting once again under the home tab go to clear rules and there you will find the option of clear rule from selected cell you may do that there is another option you may see which is clear rule from entire sheet you may go for this entire sheet option if there are plenty of conditional formatting which has been set in a particular sheet and you want to remove all the conditional formatting in this case you need not to select any particular range so right now I'm going for clear rule from selected cell 
and the rule has been cleared so this is how you need to use conditional formatting you may set a rule and this is how you need to clear that rule in the further videos we are going to explore all the options which are there in conditional formatting thank you for watching have a nice day